It was this a is hard pass, Kyle. Oh, yeah. This is hard pass. That's I'm going to give it up. Let's do it. All right. So, yes, oh. the best rapper to ever come out of the Carolinas. Yep. Young Jermaine himself. Shout out to J. Cole, man. Dropped a song called Port Antonio. Yep. Fire. I thought it was a really good. Re- it, you know what it reminded me of? What's that? <laughs> Did that feel fake? <laughs> I knew where he was going. But. Yeah, all right, all right. Yeah. You know what it reminded me of? It reminded me of the old cold. Yeah. Now, when I say the old cold, right, when I push play and it started going, yeah. in my mind, I was thinking too deep for the intro. That's a fact. I ain't even thought about that, but yeah, it, that, it, it, it is given 2011 cold, yeah. 2010, 2011 cold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's where it wrong for me. That's my favorite uh, cold song of all time. Yeah. Now, this didn't deliver. What was like, your favorite cold song? Too deep for the intro. Okay, all right. Okay. What's your favorite cold song? It ain't that one. Uh, what is it? You might be uh, shocked. Oh, man. Oh, you're going to say something like, uh, what was the song he did? Joe C. Freestyle. And <laughs> In the Morning with Drake. Oh, no, that's not bad, but it's definitely. After not what they got this. going on. <laughs> they, it, it ain't a hard take. <laughs> all right, so. Yes, all. He starts it off, right? Mm-hmm. And, you know, I watched a couple of videos of uh, people talking about it. But what I noticed that nobody picked up on is he said, uh, I'm not sure. He, he said in the Ville or back in back in uh, Carolina. Or something. He said something about all his skeletons being locked up back there. Yeah. And yeah, he said yeah. if he could change anything, he would have never swapped. Mm-hmm. And in my mind, what I think he's saying is whatever dirt that he got that he he's done before is in back where he from and he swapped stories with somebody oh yeah and that's why the battle thing in my opinion i did this is me just you can say i'm reaching here Mm -hmm. but this is he didn't want to get into the battle thing because they was gonna bring those skeletons up Mm -hmm. that he swapped stories with them about yeah i ain't even thought of that yeah it was somewhere in the uh first verse where he said that yeah yeah, I didn't even thought of that. I think he said back in the ville where all of my skeletons live or something like that. Yeah. But yeah. God dog. I wonder what kind of skeletons he's talking about. I don't know. I mean, he he admitted to cheating on his wife, so that don't that ain't nothing big. So it it gotta be something where it's like, I don't want nobody to know that one about me. God dog. It, that's what I yeah, I, no, I, I feel I, I might be reaching here, but I mean yeah. I was taking his words for what he was saying. Yeah, you know I what I'm saying? Yeah, and yeah, yeah, that's yeah. what I pulled from that. Yeah. But anyway, the song overall. Yeah. I like it. You like it? I like it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I would say it's probably the best I heard from Cole in a while. I wouldn't say that. You no. wouldn't say that? No, I heard what, it. What's better than all that? He spit a lot of verses on people's songs that was better than this. I'm talking about his song. Oh, okay. His. Cause cause think now, uh I might did did lead late late lay later. Yeah. This is better than all of that. I gotta go back and listen to it. Cause I listen only listened to, to Might Delete Later like three times. Dang. And then after he apologized, I was I nah, wasn't listening done. to that yeah. no more. <laughs> yeah. I, I uh went back and listened to it probably two, three weeks ago. It's okay. uh underrated as crap. But. I don't think it's underrated. I think it's just it, it was a mixtape, so people wasn't ranking it high like that. Yeah, let me slide my mic over real quick. But yeah, man. Um, so whenever he first apologized, <laughs> I mm. wanted the uh, battle. You know yeah, what I'm saying I Same. wanted to see him, him and uh, Kendrick go at it. Toe for it, toe. It, it blow was for Drake yeah. went up in there. You know, Drake could have get it too. Mm-hmm. Um, and then whenever he had waved the white flag, I was looking at it like, man, it, it's a battle, nigga, rap. Mm-hmm. Get what I'm saying, mm-hmm. but uh, but yeah, I mean, he waved, waved the white flag. I was disappointed after seeing how things pan out. <sighs> I'm not proud to say this. No, I ain't proud to say this, right? Hot take, Chuck in the building. Go ahead. <laughs> after seeing how things play out, I would have do the same thing. No way. I would have do the same thing. Why? After because he he clearly said in this mm-hmm. that he. Was seeing where it was going, mm-hmm. and he chose to lose lose the battle and keep a friend. I would do that nine okay. times now, out I, of ten. I understand that part, mm-hmm. but would you have dropped the diss track and then went on stage and apologized for it? After I first got this, I would make the phone call and see what there was going go. on. There you that, go. But. but that's not what he did, though. That's a fact, and that's why. 
Mm-hmm. I see it a little differently. Let's just be honest, though, Trav. Talk about it. If J. Cole stayed in that beef, mm-hmm. he would have murked Kendrick and Drake easily. Well, he wasn't going to... Drake, he was going to be the only person on Drake's side. He would have murked Kendrick. There you go. See, that's the thing, though, right? It would have been easy. I don't... <laughs> It would have been like Michael Jordan playing Derek Fisher one on one. I I don't see it that way, but hey, I'm glad you see it that way. Right. Now we can talk about it. Cause here's the thing. Go ahead. If you would have asked me to pick a person that I, I think Cole can be right there with Kendrick, I don't know if he's gonna win or lose. I know he right there though. I, if you was to ask me to pick who I think will win, I got my money on Cole. When Kendrick dropped Euphoria, that went to show. It it ain't it ain't all sweet like that. If 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 Cole put his, his personal friendship with Kendrick aside and it was just like made made the best man win. Yeah, but see I done heard plenty of Kendrick. Mm-hmm. I done heard plenty of Cole. Mm-hmm. Kendrick punch lines, they not hitting how Cole punch lines is. Kendrick wordplay ain't hitting like Cole wordplay is. The only thing Kendrick got is that auto tune and that funny voice. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Other than that, if we talking straight up balls and let's be honest, Trav. I'm listening. Kit, J- Cole, Cole could have dropped a, a fire diss track seven days in a row. I don't think Kendrick could have keep up. I respect it, but but what? Let we can go with what we got. Mm-hmm. We got seven minute drill. That's a fact. What would you think of it? The old Chuck would have said it was trash. <laughs> this truck is saying this Chuck is saying it 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 could not compete with what Kendrick and Drake both did. Thank you. I respect that. That's a fact. But that's all we got though. That's, that's all what... we got to go off of, and that's what I'm I'm giving you the objective side because I like I said I would pick Cole. And before this battle, your take of all Kendrick got is that uh uh the uh the voice change stuff. I would agree with, but in my opinion, Euphoria show levels. That's a fact, and that's why I just I don't know, I don't know. But what I do give you one hundred percent, well, not give you, well, you did kind of say uh, Kendrick with the uh, punchline things is is not his delivery ain't as Cole can take something simple Mm -hmm. and make it complex and the the simple minded person can still get it yeah that punchline is still hit that that's where kendrick be dropping the ball sometimes because he'll say something uh with a entendre and you got to think about it and then you catch it or you know whatever like that cole when he say it that first time most of the time people catch it that's a fact and i think that that's where he could bar kendrick up but I'm not. I don't know, man. I don't know. Hey, you know what? I'm. I'm gonna play deeper into it to try to make it happen. I don't know, Cole. I don't know. Don't say that, sir. I don't know. We I, and will we ever know? Well, it don't look like we'll ever know. I feel you on that. Let Let's take uh, Kendrick charged up on ten. Mm-hmm. Let's take Cole charged up on ten. Mm-hmm. You got King Kong versus uh what 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 a dinosaur name? The people in uh. Godzilla. Hong Kong scared him. Yeah, you got King Kong versus Godzilla. Both mm-hmm. of them charged up. Mm-hmm. Who you got? Both of them on ten. See, you, I feel like you're trying to put me in a. I, I'm picking Cole. I'm That's all, all I want. I'm to say. always picking Cole. I mean, is it biased? Maybe. <laughs> hey, you stupid! Shout but, out to Cole and Kendrick. Though. But uh, yeah, I I I don't know. I don't know. And I feel like at this point, we'll never know. He talk about he finally free. Yeah. What are uh, you free from, Chuck? I think he's free from the um, being in that, you know, gold top tail thing. Mm-hmm. Kendrick said the crown is heavy. Mm-hmm. So I think now Cole is free from, from that crown. Okay. okay. That's what, what I think he meant. So now he can just breathe easy and do him mm-hmm. and let his fans say, nah, Cole is like that versus him. You know. So so like basically that. he's saying I don't care if I'm never number one. It was an honor to be up uh acknowledged to be up there. That and behind that, some people gonna still say I'm number one. But they're gonna be fans and it's bias. 
I think he's fine with that. Oh, okay. I okay. think he he's uh, fine with that. All right, well, let's get to it. Yep. Kendrick, the, the man is cold-blooded, man. Shark that in the man, water. Well, let me say this. Shark in the water. He, behind the scenes, he might let that friendship stuff rock. But in front of the public... <laughs> He don't care about none That's of that. That's a fact. That That's man fact. said that crown is mine. That's a fact. <laughs> That's a fact. Shout I, out to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, hey. Let, let, let me uh say this, right? Mm -hmm. I compare Kendrick to Kobe. Okay. I compare For sure. J. Cole to Braun. Okay. I respect right. that. Yeah. Braun, you supposed to beat Kobe yeah. nine times out of ten. Yeah, yeah. But Kobe got that mindset. He of. got that dog to mm -hmm. wear. Like, I don't care if your kid's on the sideline. Right. You about to get me. <laughs> and that's why, you know, I do see why people would put Kendrick mm -hmm. ahead because of yeah. Kendrick a dog. He, he is. is sharp. He is. J. Cole a team player. That's a fact. Kendrick selfish. It's a good thing in he this. He said that. He said yeah. that. He, he said, it's, I'm a selfish dude. The crown is heavy. That's a fact. That, and I pray y'all my real friends. If not, YNW Melly. <laughs> Shout out to Kendrick, though, man. That That's crazy. That's funny. It's, it's, anyway. All right. So let's get to it. Yeah. What do you think about what he said to Drake? He said that uh, they said I'm picking size. Don't you lie on me. Oh, yeah. Drake, you'll always be my, my dude or whatever. Yeah. I, I think that was him trying to make. I'm trying to piece it up. Do you think that they're... All right. So, on push-ups and family matters, Cole caught some strays on there. <laughs> yep. You think Cole was reaching out to Drake and Drake wasn't responding? I'm not sure if he wasn't responding, but I know... Well, I think Drake feels some type of way about how Cole... Handled the whole situation. Yeah. About, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, and may, maybe Cole just trying to piece it up. But, I mean, you got to understand, though, right? It's mm -hmm. like... Man, say what y'all want about Drake. He a dog, too. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm I, saying? I, 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 exactly. That's exactly where it goes. It, the, the crown is heavy, and Drake yeah. is like, I still aware that motherfucker. Yeah, man. I ain't even going to cap to you. Uh, most people got Drake losing this battle, mm -hmm. but I think Drake still got that uh, crown, though. Mm. I think he's still walking around with that crown mm, mm. let me get give you another basketball reference right mm -hmm. most people got brown above kobe that's true right but then if you look at brown versus kobe one-on-one -on -one, mm -hmm. no picks no back no cuts me and you yeah kobe cooked them that might be drake yeah and kendrick yeah but yeah. i still think drake got the crown but uh i think uh right now people can say kendrick got his uh yeah number, though. yeah yeah for sure for sure that's just me for sure, that's a good analogy right there. America won't won't agree, but all right. So let's get to it. Let's do it. Who you think text him? <laughs> <laughs> now, nah, whenever he says somebody uh uh text him, I I, I want to say probably thirty three percent of me is thinking it, it's uh Kendrick because mm -hmm. Kendrick has been known to. Do the behind this publicly the scenes, yeah. and then behind the scenes text. So Pitch, yeah. uh, a part of me is thinking that it might have been Kendrick, like like may, may, maybe Cole backed out. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, then Kendrick was like, "Man, it's just rap. Just keep it." They just said, "Man, you are good." Sin. Yes. You know what I'm saying? That, that's what I think happened. But, I think uh, it was more like uh, Kendrick texted him and said, "Hey, I know what I said, but this is really more me and Drake." But me and you can keep it friendly, but I know me and Drake are going to go left. But just because the gun don't shoot, that don't mean it ain't deadly, bro. Hey, you stupid. <laughs> hey, you stupid. It was the deadly. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> but with that being said, though, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, well, honestly, I think he was saying, hey, this is really between me and Drake. Me and you can keep it friendly, but this is really between me and Drake. If you want to keep going, we can go, but... It's okay if you, you know, don't want to, because we don't have to. This is really between me and Drake. Yeah. In hindsight, I don't blame Cole for, for stopping. Mm -hmm. I think Cole probably knew some stuff we didn't know. Nah, bro. Nah. Let, let, we, let, I'm about, oh, wait. I, you, you guys, you, you want to keep going? Because go I'm ahead. about to really get to it. Let's talk about it. You about, about to call J. Cole? Yeah. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> First, first person shooter. Yeah, 
That's Drake. And that's cold together. That's a fact. Drake ain't said nothing about Kendrick. Drake ain't acknowledged Kendrick in that song. Well, if he did, it was in an insulting way after Cole acknowledged Kendrick. Nobody said nothing about Kendrick to Cole coming talking about some uh people always talking about the big three. Is it K Dot? Is it Arby and me? We mm. the big three like we started the league. That's a fact. But right now I'm feeling like Muhammad Ali. What is that saying? He no more. He the greatest. Yeah. He started the song off with numero UNO. Yep, that's a fact. Number one. Now the crown is heavy. That's a fact. If 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 I think that we, me, you, and uh, me, Kendrick, and Drake are yeah. the are the big three. Yeah. And I feel like I'm number one. And that motherfucker come say mother f- the big three. He yeah. said it. He said it with emphasis. He said it like he meant that. He felt. I when I heard that, I felt like it came from his soul. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you stupid. Yeah, hey, I feel you. <laughs> but yeah. That's directly at Cole. Cause Drake never said anything about Big Three in in, in the first person shooter. Okay, so you 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 saying that that line was from Kendrick. We talking about the Kendrick to J. Cole this or the J. Cole saying he feel like Ali? I'm talking about straight up from uh here's numero what UNO. Yeah, yeah. Here's what I'm saying. Yeah. A lot of what Kendrick responded to mm-hmm. was Playing off of what J. Cole said. So, what I'm saying is, J. Cole started this whole thing. He did not. <laughs> Go ahead. Drake said. I'm listening. Did, what, what he said, the beef man go. He, what, 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 oh, no, what? no, no. Yeah, he said that this been brewing in a pot. Now I'm heating so up. So, with, with J. Cole. Oh, what did he say? Uh, that little song y'all got did not start to yeah, be for us. Yeah, 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 yeah. So with J. Cole though, mm-hmm, right? I mm-hmm. feel like he I don't think he started it. J. Cole was saying he feel like he's number one. Here's the thing. Go ahead. Go ahead. Here's the thing. Go ahead. I think yep. if Drake and J. Cole do that song mm-hmm. and, and J. Cole don't say anything related to Kendrick, it goes under the rug and Kendrick and Drake just keep sneak dissing each other. They don't ever actually get into a battle mm-hmm. i think the fact that drake and j cole did that song and uh, kendrick got mentioned made him say nah f- that that don't mean cole started it cole I mean, started Kend- this man kendrick started it when j cole was bigging everybody up no he was but kendrick wants to be number one and j cole said he number one so kendrick so- started it Kendrick Bro. dropped that the big three. J. Cole was like, yeah, it's all three of us. We, we can take top. it back further to control when Kendrick said, I'm going to be number one. I'm coming for all of y'all. I got love for all of y'all, but I'm coming for all of y'all. That don't hold no weight because every rapper in the world done said that. But if anybody said it, guess who Guess who said something about it? Who? Kendrick! <laughs> I stand on. Okay. Cole was hyping everybody up. He was, but he said he number one, though. He said, if me and you do a song. It, uh, let me tell you what Cole did. Cole said, yeah, all of us good now, but I'm the best. <laughs> no, that's yeah. not what he did. That's what he did. No, he did not. He said, we the big three, but I'm Muhammad Ali. I'm the best. First of all, Muhammad Ali is not the the the, 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 the best boxer of all time. Who but, do you say is? Real quick. Who the best is? Yeah, all I, the time. I, I think uh, probably Tyson. I think he had knock out Ali. He had not knock out Floyd. You can't put Floyd in there. <laughs> Floyd eighty. What? Well, what is eighty and oh? Yeah, but Floyd is like one hundred and twenty five pounds. It don't matter. <laughs> Tyson is. <laughs> it don't matter. <laughs> Niggas Tyson compare Jordan and Braun. <laughs> that, <laughs> that's different. No, it's not. <laughs> Floyd say he the greatest. I think uh, Tyson will knock him out. But anyway, let me Good. let me say say this right. right let's get. To I it, feel yeah. like it was one of those things. How we going back to LeBron? LeBron yeah. would say he's the greatest mm-hmm. ever, mm-hmm. but he don't want smoke with nobody. He want to team up. Yeah, get what what what, what I'm saying. So it was Kendrick over there, like like I right, he 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 saying Kobe. he the greatest. He yeah, Kobe. I'm gonna show him. Yeah, I don't feel like. Cole was saying he was better than Kendrick. Because it's a difference in... Hold on, Trav. No, I ain't saying nothing. I ain't saying nothing. It, it, <laughs> it's the difference in me saying 
uh, we got the best podcast in the world, mm-hmm. and me saying we got a better podcast than so and so podcast. Okay, it's a difference. If you say you got the greatest podcast in the world, shout out to you. Keep going. It's all love. But once you say we got a better podcast, or our podcast is better than so and so and so. That's yeah. whenever it come personal. Get what I'm saying? So. Like I said, Cole showed nothing but love. Mm-hmm. Get what I'm saying? So I, I think Kendrick's taught of it. <sighs> that's, that's the truth. <laughs> that's your truth. Because my truth is saying, if they are really friends, mm-hmm. and I know how competitive he is, I would know that me saying this is going to rile him up. Maybe he didn't know. And maybe they're not really friends then. I think they and I if think they're, not they're really cool. Friends, I don't think they're friends. I think they're cool. That's even more why I think Cole should have won at him. Nah, I, I don't think so. I don't think so. Cause not, wait, all right, if they cool or friends, like we, I, I feel like there's a line there. If, if Cole knew where it was going, right? Yeah, but see, here's the thing, right? And I, 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 I was saying the same thing, and then somebody pointed this out to me. Cole apologized before Kendra said anything. How he know where it's going? <laughs> So check it out. Uh-huh. Let's say you you got a bully in school. Yeah. Right. The bully come hit you. Mm-hmm. You gonna hit back. Mm-hmm. The bully like I. So it's room rumors around school at three o'clock. That dude gonna get get you. Mm-hmm. You go to uh second period. They like yeah man. Don't even sweat, buddy. He like that. His parents don't love him. His mama a three or four. His daddy walked out of his life. By three o'clock, it's like you know what, man. I don't even want no problems with you. Dang, I find that acceptable. <laughs> I do I see, because I, I you, you you hit me. I swung back. Uh, we were supposed to fight, and I thought about everything, and I'm like, you know what? It ain't worth it. And let's just be honest, J Cole. This was not really a diss. Get what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, it was a, you sure you want to do this? Yeah, so, <laughs> hey, I, I don't blame Cole for not engaging in the beef. Yeah. If it was just bars, mm-hmm. then yeah, Cole, you jump up in there. But in hindsight, after everything played out, I don't think most people would have <laughs> done, I don't think most people, if that was your friend, I don't think most people would have done what they did when... You know, whenever everything played out. So, I don't blame Cole. And I ain't taking enough for Cole. Because I came up here and I said, you can never put Cole above Kendrick ever again. Because mm-hmm. I thought it was just bars. I mm-hmm. thought it was just hip-hop. I, I still feel like it was. but It's I, not. not between Kendrick and Cole. I felt like that between Kendrick and Drake. No, I never felt like that between Kendrick. I Kendrick. felt like that. They, they've been throwing shots at each other through, throughout the years. And but Jay-Z tell, and Wayne have been throwing shots at each other for like 10 years. It wasn't like how Kendrick and Drake doing though. You sure? Not, not to my, uh, not from my standpoint. Because Wayne, Wayne ain't even this Beyonce trying to piss Jay Z off. Yeah, that's yeah, the yeah. ultimate thing there. Well, Jay Z and Nas, they cool now, and they, you know, had a little whatever. But who you say Jay Z and who? Nas. You don't know who that is? No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, go ahead. <laughs> but no, no, no. Like they, the personal shots that they did to each other throughout the years. It's a dude on YouTube. Well, he's not on YouTube no more, but his name was The Dirt. And he uh, did a whole unpacking of every time Drake diss Kendrick yeah, and every time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, it was like little subtle things where you think that, uh, like on the language, you think Drake just rapping, but he actually dissing Kendrick. And the only person that really know, well, Kendrick, first time hearing it, he knows dissing him. But most people just sitting there like. One of my favorite songs. It, it, I don't know why they've been lying, but Josh is not that inspiring. That's a fact. And I didn't know he was talking to Kendrick at the time. And then, yeah, he just kept going. And then I was like, I think uh, uh, Kai ended up pointing it out to me. He said, yeah, you didn't notice that uh, Drake was talking to Kendrick on there? I was like, nah. But yeah, it was just like, throughout the years, the language on was on nothing was the same. Yeah, my, both favorite, of them, my favorite Drake album. Both of them done, this, what, uh, done dropped, what, five albums since then? And I'm yeah, just throwing yeah, a number yeah, out there. Yeah. But, yeah, and every album, they throwing shots at each other. They ain't like each other for a long time. I feel you. I still want to know what it is that uh, uh, Kendrick said, you know, we got some stuff to address. I want to know what that stuff is. 
It's something because th- there was something that happened that made them, you know. You don't think have Drake tried try, try to smash his girl? It's possible. That's what I think it is. Okay. Drake, uh, uh boy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, well, hey, drop down in the comments, man. Let us know what y'all think about uh, Port Antonio and what do y'all think is next for the big three. Yeah, before we close it out, rank the big three, one through three. Kendrick, Drake, uh, Cole. I got a Drake, uh, Kendrick, Cole. Okay. I still got Drake with the crown. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, that might be another video, but yeah, I think Drake still got the crown. Uh, I think Kendrick got his number right now, but I think Drake still got the crown. Yeah, yeah. What ranking them right now? You still got Drake ahead. See, I'm, I'm thinking about the the, the past. totality. Yeah, because if you do the totality, then I put Drake ahead. Yeah, that that's. But what I was I'm talking, talking about, about right now. If we talking about 2024, it's Kendrick by far. Yeah, but if we talk about the totality, I still think Drake got the crown. Yeah, because back to what you were saying earlier, I in the back and forth with the songs. I don't feel like Drake lost. It was just all of the stuff that transpired afterwards that made him lose. That's a fact. For me. I feel you on that. Yeah. Yeah. I feel you on that. But yeah. All right. All right. Bye.